hi everyone i'm somia crypto you're watching my binance bcat story on crypto tv plus keep watching hello everyone um so my crypto i'm a financial analyst i'm a crypto influencer i'm a binance influencer uh i think it was in binance blockchain week then I met um, the crypto TV people and I heard Big Cat, I was like, ah, what was this event again? Event in an event, so what was this and all. Then I heard about the vision and I was like, okay, no problem, where is it? They said Enugu, Southeast. No, so basically I think I bought into the vision before even the event and because I'm a social media person, I talk a lot about crypto on several apps, Instagram, Twitter, I'm on all apps, actively as a crypto influencer. So I was I was already promoting events because I believe in the vision. Common is part of what I do already. So young people, empowerment, and as a woman in this space, I believe in the vision. Then they called me up and said, oh, you are going to be speaking on it. I was like, okay, no problem. I'm going to share and shed more light on blockchain awareness, crypto and everything around that. Yeah. So it was Iron Cross because like <laughs> we're together. Like so it was after so like after the event there's like breaks and it was like oh you are a social media influencer, you do for crypto, you do this, you do that. And Cross was there and we just bought into the vision and we went with it and never looked back. And thank God it was a success. So he was like, okay, he came at me, okay, oh, you are a woman in the space, um, you are setting barriers and people look up to you as a woman, as a trader, because then I'm not just an influencer, I'm a trader, as a trader in the space. So you can also come and show people more opportunities, that it's not just about trading, because people just think, oh, crypto is trade, 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 trade. But like there are other aspects, there's content creation, there's crypto blogging, there's crypto jobs and companies, what convinced me to join the Bcat movement because it was I'm more like a grassroots person. Anybody that knows me will know. Oh, somewhere is one person that talks to everybody. There's opportunity for anybody. So Bcat was like a platform. I think that's what I'll say because then I work because then it's hard for people to know about these things. I can be just one person doing my own normal or influencing, saying oh you can do content, oh you can do. But Bika gave me a voice and like a platform to like showcase people to these things. It's more like a structure. Coming for Bika, yeah, it was smooth. I had to get to Lagos because there's no direct flight to Enugu, <laughs> which was stressful. So I got in at night. The next morning, I was planning to come on Friday. I got in like on Wednesday. I said, okay, I'll come to Enugu on Friday. They say no. They say everybody has been here. You must come the next morning. I said, Jesus Christ, God. Well, like, ah, Bika, Bika, let's just, let's just do this and let's just do this, yeah. And then I came to Inugu, I swear everybody, like, from the airport, I got to the hotel, they said, okay, the hall, I said, ah, people don't day hall. I said, okay, <laughs> maybe they're going to hall now. I got to the hall, I saw everybody, everybody was, oh, are you so mad? I was like, ah, okay, God. They said there was dev, I think dev conference that night, so, so, the next night, something like that. And I saw the hall, I said, okay. Where do you guys get people to fill this hall? They say, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I say, okay, well, may I do video? <laughs> may I tell Instagram people, say, oh, hold on, they will full low. They sent another hall downstairs. I said, ah. I came downstairs, I saw the boots. I was like, this is Dubai in Nigeria. Like, you know when you go for like events in Dubai and you're like, you come here and you're saying, what's even Lagos? Like, Enugu, how did you guys do that? Like, so... It was just really amazing. I sent to the Binance team. I was like, ah, see what this people are doing. <laughs> see what they were like, ah, are like, you sure this is Enugu and everything? Even some like white, like foreigners that like I met, they were like, ah, this is Nigeria. I said, Nigeria, Nigeria. The Southeast, South. I have to be saying Southeast because we are saying Enugu. Why is it? You might not really get what you're saying. So you have to say Southeast Nigeria. So it was, it was really great. Mika was not a waste of my time. I think I tell people like even um, the first life I had with Ikat, the main guest missed it. I would have said normally busy. I could just tell and say, please, I beg, I'm busy, too busy. Because then I do Twitter space, and I think I'm the only active. No, even do I'm the only active person on 
Twitter and Instagram, then TikTok, then Snap. Ah, uh-uh, ah, no one kill me. So I was like, oh, okay, because I believe in this vision. We had to reschedule, and the next day I came up with it, like, and I was there on the Instagram live and all. I was really active on. People see me and call me big cat. That's how bad it is, because they. <laughs> I have some people I walk with they're like please be happy Pamo they will be safe they make noise everything so it was a waste of my time and it has done a lot even after math um, uh, it took let me know let me know we'll see that one later I think connecting with great minds because if you check it I've had friends in the crypto space for years that I have never met just know this some people we even talk every day like some of them we are on the same twitter space every day but then imagine you just chilling with the ceo of an exchange or you guys are having breakfast together you can then share ideas not like you just want to have fun and then share ideas easily connecting with grassroots some people that they see me and they think i'm i'm not a proud person i talk to everybody i tell people they feel they can't talk to you online and then they're meeting you somewhere <laughs> things like that then be cats is like a movement i tell people it's not just an event it gave it made people because some people if they just hear someone talking about something solo they will just be like waiting someone they talk or she be a woman because you're a woman in the space waiting she they talk so it gave people a the awareness part too yeah that's the physical part i'm talking about the awareness part online because then people young people are online doing all sorts of things so you coming online and telling them okay oh, you can do this you can do that you can do this it was it was really great yes it was great so if you're a newbie you don't know what crypto is you don't know what blockchain is you think say the thing hard pass it as you look maybe as you they see chats if they fear you you don't want trade you maybe want to you just maybe have like a skill and then you want to maybe you are a photographer you are a content you might even just be an instagram influencer that's why i was before obviously i was training but like i never even told anybody what i was doing because then society is just tends to look down on women so if you didn't know me personally you won't even know i was a trader because just the trade low key nobody knew i was doing it like i said okay i just posted a chat one day and then we were like, ah, what was this? Intrigued, intrigued. I said, yeah, I be like, say, this thing will get traction. Eh? Next day, I wrote the write up RSI, can you call, can you call? They like, ah. I said, okay, no problem. That was how I entered crypto influencer, trust me. That was how, I, and now brands pay me to even get settled with them. That was just it. So there is a way, like, you can literally apply, like, I always say, apply your web two skills in web three don't confuse it it means what you're doing now in the real world you can also use these skills to make money i'm not don't do any free thing no make money with it if you're a photographer if you can snap picture and you come out fine if you can if you're a tech person if you are whatever you do basically in your real life you can also come into this space this space is big to accommodate anybody amazing <laughs> amazing <laughs> no because blew my mind like everybody everywhere i posted it on they were like ah, enugu how how where so even people that are now trying to do crypto events everybody literally wants me on their team because ah they're like ah you're the team of bikas what do people do i said no go there you come and join <laughs> come and join so it was really it was really it was really cross self when you post everybody all the old speakers People that did not even come, you know, say it's okay. I don't want to talk. Yes, yeah, sure. that's it. Hi, everyone. I'm Sumer Crypto. I'm a financial analyst. Crypto influencer with Binance. Keep watching Crypto TV Plus. <laughs>